Kelly Kirkland composition, Viata. And on the piano, Venus the Vitus. introduce myself. Uh, I'm a jazz singer. Uh, last year I graduated from the Lithuanian Academy of Music and Theatre with a bachelor's degree in jazz vocals. At present I'm enrolled at Berklee College of Music in Boston. Uh, I'm preparing for my departure, for my studies, and I'm searching for financing of my tuition. tuition. In my creative life, I focus not only composing and performing, but also in musical exploration, in art fusion, collective improvisation, therapy of musical improvisation, communication dynamics, therapy, possibilities and analysis. Uh, amongst my creative output you would find traditional mainstream jazz, such as you have heard one and two to world music, contemporary, free jazz, and body art performances. Uh, today we'll try some of collective improvisation together. So, the theme of today is self-discovery in music. Music is often considered as a source for relaxation, as well as a, an art uh, for entertainment, dance, a leisure. However, however, we sometimes go to the concerts for attentive listening. That is the type I would like to talk about, not the music for background, not the background music or music for pure entertainment. During the serious concerts, we analyze, draw parallels, discover something familiar from ourselves or our 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 experiments and uh, and uh, and ex experiences. However, if we take a look from another analytic side, we can notice that from time to time music provides us an opportunity to perceive events, emotions and situations differently. And, uh, and the same thing, including composition and improvisation as well, as well its consumption as a product. Let's uh, single out two main aspects. 
listening, and performing. While listening, we are absolutely free from standards. We can come across surprising colors uh, from our senses and to uh, remember certain events from our past, we can see the colors of our own emotions. In composing and performing music, we're absolutely free from standard images, from stereotypes, and that is because the sounds of music are highly abstract and can mean entirely different things for each individual. For example, all of us would most likely agree that uh, in C7 chord, please, yeah, thank you. In C7 chord, some people hear brightness, some oblivion, others maybe a question or an intrigue. Everybody's description would be different. In that case, what does that say about our personalities? Exactly applies, uh, exactly the same applies to music composition and performance as we are not limited to any form and we can liberate our connection to a certain emotion. And so while well, known pieces of music bring different emotions to every one of us. Now, I would like to talk about more improvisation. Every, our emotion and experience can be accompanied by music. However, it is very important to know how to use it. Uh, every person can discover themselves through the sound which she or he sings or plays. Not only musicians can improvise. Yeah, improvisation can be practiced by each individual uh, when you're alone and uh, practice individual in like a way to self-discovery and who is interested in self-discovery and in their inner world. I think it's very important to be interested in your inner world. And uh, you can ask me and you and you, how can I do it? Yeah, how can you do it? <laughs> well, I think it's, it's simple. When you're all by yourselves, just to try to calm down and listen to your inner rhythm. And when in complete silence you hear a sound, don't be afraid and realize it. It doesn't matter what it is like, harsh or soft, beautiful or not, short or flowing. Sometimes it is more effective to fit your entire emotion into one sound than sing out many sounds without any emotions. Uh, now, as you heard, I would like to invite you for a slightly different experiment. I invite you with your thoughts to leave this hall and concentrate onto yourself. Now just sit back and relax, okay? Relax. <laughs> Now let us all close your eyes. Don't be shy, just close your eyes, okay? Now let's take one note, E flat, please. And let's sing it together, okay? sound you're realizing and without interruption sing this note okay without interruption without a pause we'll sing this only one note okay close your eyes and start put all the all the energy you have right now into one note all your emotions everything what you have your mind put into one sound. And now I'll sing a melody, I'll improvise, and you listen to me. And when you hear that I finished my melody, just slowly and quietly open your eyes. Please louder.
Thank you very much. 